Mother's Day is right around the corner and I was trying to come up with a project to film. I came across how to watercolor fabric, so I took those instructions and applied them to a pillowcase. So let's get started. For this project you'll need watercolor paints, a pillowcase, you can get a pre-made one or you can make one yourself, fabric medium, this can turn any kind of paint into a fabric paint, just follow the instructions on your bottle. You'll also need something to cover up your work area, I used a black garbage bag, two cups filled with one quarter cup of water, and a few paint brushes. Start by covering your work area, you don't want the paint to stain the surface that you're working on. You can paint on your pillowcase one of two ways. You can leave the pillowcase dry and use the watercolors on it, or you can wet the pillowcase and then paint on it. With the wet pillowcase, the paint will spread a little more than if it were dry. Experiment with it to see which way you like better. Once you decide wet or dry, you can start painting on your fabric using your first quarter cup of water. The more water you use with the paint, the lighter the color will be and the drier your brush is, the more pigmented your color will be. If you accidentally put too much paint down, you can always dilute it with some water. You can use as many or as little colors as you want. You can go back and blend your colors together as well. I went back in with some white and blended it into some spots. I also used the white to blend the colors together. When you're finished painting, you can take your second quarter cup of water and mix it with 1 8 cup of fabric medium. Paint the mixture onto the entire surface of the pillowcase. Once you're done, you can let it air dry overnight. The fabric medium needs to be heat set, so when it's done air drying, throw it into your dryer on high heat for about 15 minutes. And you're done. Thanks so much for watching my newest video. If you liked it, let me know. And check back soon for some more videos. Also, don't forget to subscribe and follow me on Facebook and Instagram. See you again soon. Bye!